Hey guys, this is Shay with Chalkin' with Shay. Uh, today we're going to make a really cool menu board for your kitchens. So um, I have a, the camera in a different spot here, so I am just checking that out to see if that's going to work a little bit better. So I'm going to wait here a couple minutes for you guys to pop in. This is going to be really, really cool once we're done. I'm really excited about it. We're going to be working with a really big board today, too. Okay, so... Alrighty. Hey, Stephanie, good to see you. I got my camera in a different spot today. I'm just trying things out. Okay. I'm almost ready to get started. Okay. All right. So, here we go. Hey, Margaret. All right, so this is the transfer that we're going to use. And we are using um, one of our largest Grayson boards, if you can see that. Um, this is going to be kind of tricky because we're working on a really large board. And my desk is not all that large. So, I hope to make this work okay. Probably going to have to stand up for part of it. Okay. So what time is it? It's 4.25. Okay, so this is going to be a menu board. This is going to be really awesome. I love these um, chalk couture transfer trimmers because these are not like your typical scissors. They're extra long, it feels like. And so you can, they're, they're sharp and long, and so you can really cut these transfers out quick and easy. didn't have that quite cut good enough. There we go. Okay, that's one piece out of about 20. I don't think that I'm going to use these ones on the side, breakfast, lunch, dinner, dessert, and drinks. I'm just going to use the days of the week. And actually, I wonder if I could use a smaller board. I think I'm going to. Well, let me cut the rest of these out. What I love about our transfers is that they are, they give you all sorts of pieces. So you don't just, if you want to create more than just one piece with it, you can. Um, and you can use your creativity so it doesn't have to be cut, it doesn't have to be created in one particular way. You can do it whatever suits your family. So for my family, it works best to um, make a board that has every day of the week on it, as opposed to daily. So if I had it daily, then I would put breakfast, lunch, dinner, dessert, and drinks, and then I could, you know, each day list out what those were going to be. So you can totally create it however you want which makes for perfect versatility. But I suspect I'm gonna want the smaller um, 
the smaller board. Which will be better for you guys because you'll be able to see better. So what are you guys up to today? Today has been a day for me to work in my office. I have been on the go literally nonstop for three days and I really hate that. Um, Friday night I was with my sister and my mom and my cousins and my niece because my cousin was in from out of town and then Saturday I suddenly went swimming with my um, daughter, my sister, and my niece. My sister, I mean my daughter was just going to go with my niece and my sister but then at the last minute they in invited me and I decided to go with them. I would have been invited a long time ago, but I told them I didn't really care to swim so much. Um, but then right as my daughter was leaving, I said, you know, I kind of wish I was going. And she said, oh, please do, please do. And she really begged. So how do you say no to your daughter when she begs you to go swimming with her? She's 19, so I feel pretty good that she wanted me to tag along. We have a salt and pepper shaker here and see ya, Jordan. Um, and some fork, knife, and spoon. And this is the one we're not gonna use, but I'm gonna go ahead and cut it out just so that I can um, get these cleaned up, put all together and cleaned up when we're done. Okay, so we're done with the scissors. I'm gonna put these pieces away. And I don't think I'm gonna use those either. And I don't think I want today's special, but I do want the days of the week. Okay, so now, um, you guys, I don't think you're able to see me too well. There we go. Okay, so. Oh, um, hang on, don't go anywhere, I'll be right back. I'm back so I just wanted to get this board to see if it would work any better hi Susan thanks for joining us so this fits nicely there and then let's see. could do Monday Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. If I were to do this, I probably wouldn't have enough room well, maybe I would have room for the salt and pepper shaker. I don't know if you guys are able to see. I wish Facebook would let us do this horizontally, but they don't. They're stupid that way. Okay, so I think I'm going to go with the small board, at least for now, and see how that goes. I can always change it up later.
Okay. Well, this will make it easier for me to create while you guys are watching me. Okay, so with this board, this is the kitchen measurement conversions that I did last week. So I'm gonna just change it up. Okay. So um, I'm just using one of our board erasers. That's just one of our board erasers. And this comes off now you do have to scrub this, so it's not like it comes off um, so easy that it'll come off accidentally, but it does come off easy enough when you scrub it like this. guys are quiet today. Okay. I'm just going to use my towel to dry it off. And then I'm gonna use my heat gun just to make sure it's good and dry. Okay, now to start with the menu, because that's the biggest piece. give this a good fuzzing. This feels like it's not too sticky, but sticky enough to work. Okay. Are you guys able to see okay? I want this as close to the top as I possibly can get, and it looks like it might cut off just a smidgen. Just a smidgen over here on the right is gonna get cut off, but that's okay. Um, I'm not picky and my kids are actually older now. My oldest is 20, he's 20. And then my next is 19 and then 16. Thank you, Margaret, for sharing. I appreciate that. Okay, so we're working with a brand new white because I was having some issues with my other white. <sighs> okay, so today we're gonna use the four inch handled squeegee. And this is um, <clears throat> a really good squeegee to use when you are working with a large, um, a large transfer. It just makes it, um, It makes it go on easier and quicker. Okay, so let me stir this up real good. I don't think I like where I have the camera placed today. So I'm gonna have to play around with that again.
Okay, so here we go. So I'm just gonna get some blobs of chalk all over. And then we're gonna use the squeegee. See how that goes on so much quicker and easier? you guys hear about the mass shooting in Dayton? Um, that was actually right where I grew up. Scary to say. And my son was about, look at that, very, very pretty. Um, my son works literally one mile away from where it happened and he was there um, an hour before or two hours before it happened um, which is scary and I used to hang out at that strip of bars when I was in college um, some not a lot but we'd go there some so it's really kind of scary because now one of those shootings has officially hit close to home. I want to make sure this is good and dry. Oh, so I can continue on with my weekend. So I was at the pool all day Saturday and I got fried again. Hi Debbie. Um, I got fried. So I, Monday I was at my friend's place in Alliance, Ohio. She lives in a, like in, in farm country. I got completely fried on my front. So then I get healed from that and then I go swimming Friday and I got completely fried on my back. So at least I'm a little bit even. But I've been in a lot of pain the past few days. Let's see. This light. That, I think that's maybe a little bit. But can you guys see my light up here? Okay. So we are ready for the days of the week. So I'm going to put my um, handled squeegee into my bucket of water. Because I think we're done with that. Okay. So... I'd kind of like to put this week on here. I'm not really sure that's going to be smart though. Well, maybe I will. Hopefully I don't regret that decision. Okay. I'm doing the whole thing in white. Because I think white is going to show up better. And I have too much chalk on the squeegee got it all over my fingers. Okay. Literally all over my fingers. Okay.
got a squeegee and a little board hanger underneath my menu. Okay, so we are ready for the days of the week. So here is Monday. I want to put it low enough that I have room to write out what the menu is. Who likes this transfer? Give me some, give me some hearts. Um, let me see, Debbie. Let me, I'm not sure. Let me look that up. This is a E size transfer, so it is $39.99. But what I love about it is that um, when we're done with this, you can use our chalk markers, which is perfect because um, uh, let's see, Jamie, no, I sent you a personal message, but you didn't respond to me. So um, I need you to send me a personal message um, and you can either send it to my business page or my name. Hi, Kelsey. Hi, Alyssa. Um, or my name, which is Sharon Wade, W-A-D-E, Mauer. Um, so yeah, I have that waiting for you, but I just need you, uh, we need to, you know, settle up the, I need to send you an invoice. So send me a message. Okay, so anyway, so once we have it all completed, you can then use our chalk markers and you can change that out. So all of this can stay the same for eternity and then you just change out the menu each week. So it's really, really cool. Okay, I think this Monday is done. Let me double check. Okay. And if anybody wants this transfer today, um, this is the transfer of the day. And I will have, you can choose a free gift. So here is my free gift board. So you just choose numbers 1 through 12. And I have lots of really great gifts in here. And you could even earn up to $25 in chalk box. So it's really, really cool. And... Um, so just comment below transfer of the day if you want to purchase this and then um, also pick a number one through 12 and then I will then go into my customer group and announce what you've won because I can't do that in a public format. So just comment below transfer of the day if you want to purchase this one. Uh oh, I folded it, here we go. Okay, hopefully I can get these lined up real good. My family is gonna love this because they always wanna know, what's for dinner? What is for dinner? Every day I get that question. Um, all right, Debbie, congrats. You've, you're getting a free gift because you want the transfer of the day. Okay, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. These are going to be just a little off, like they're not going to be exactly left centered, but that's okay. It looks kind of cool anyways. Nobody needs perfection, am I right? Ain't nobody got time for per perfection. That's how I see it. If I spent my life trying to be perfect, I wouldn't get anything done. So I just live and let live. 
Now that's a little close together, but I'm not going to stress it. Okay. Alrighty. If I wanted to, I could redo it. I think I'm going to leave it. Well, I'm rethinking this. Hmm. I just need to go down just a smidge, but that means I'm going to have to redo this transfer, which I can't. All right, I guess I talked myself into it. Let me grab my ugly towel. Okay, I'm just drying this off real quick here. And while that's drying, I'm going to erase this. And it's really close to the Tuesday. I'm afraid I'm going to have to get out the Q-tips. Well... These are really great for back to school time. I don't know about you guys, but when my kids were younger, this is what I was all about at the beginning of the school year. It was all about getting myself organized and making up menus like this, getting real good with, you know, just all this stuff. I was seriously all into this. This is a little too close for comfort here. I think I did it. Okay, now I'm going to grab this one. Just to get all the ghosting off of it. Okay, this looks perfect. We're going to dry it. Perfect. Okay, back to Wednesday. I'm gonna use my hair dryer here just to make sure it's good and dry. I think this is perfect. At least better than it was before. Maybe not perfect. I just had a feeling that was really going to bug me throughout time and I didn't want to have to redo it. It was either redo it now or redo it later. And later was going to be tougher because then I was going to have the rest of the... It's perfect. The rest of the days of the week down there so I thought I better fix it now okay it 
So, what are you guys having for dinner tonight? As usual, I have no idea. <laughs> Let's see, it's 10 till 5, and I literally have no idea. Wednesday, here's Thursday. But that is typical for me, but in my defense, my husband is out of town, and my youngest is going to be at a sleepover. And my daughter eats like a bird. And my oldest is working. So I really have no reason to make dinner tonight. And besides, I'm on a diet. So I'm going to be... Maybe it'll be a cereal night. That sounds really good to me right now. I actually need to go to the grocery Thursday. I gotta tell you, I am loving this. And what a way to make sure that you plan out the um the days of the week so like if you're like me where you tend to get lazy and you don't plan things out but you know that you should um this is a really good way to kind of enforce that you do because you don't want to waste your cute little board Now on mine, there's obviously like, it, it gets tricky with my family because very often some members are not around. And my youngest is on this real strict diet where um, he is not eating any processed foods and he's basically kind of like on the Whole30 diet, just all the stuff that's good for you and none of the bad stuff he's 16 and he is he plays baseball so he really wants to improve himself so but i've gotten to the point now where if he was my best eater and if he's not going to be eating with me then I, you know what i'm just going to cook what i want to cook and whoever wants to jump in can eat it hi doris and whoever doesn't want to eat what I cook, that's fine. This is so fabulous. Let's see. Sunday is the last day. My kids are actually gonna love this. We're done. Well, almost. I have to add a few little decorations. But it's perfect. I kind of like made it, um, instead of left what is that called left um the alignment instead of making it a left alignment it's more kind of like a centered alignment so they're kind of centered between each other but it looks really good okay so we have salt and pepper shaker I have to figure out where to put. Maybe I 
can fit that in there and I can fit the silverware up here. Would that be too busy? I'd rather put some of it down here. I think I can do that because I can go down here if I need more space for Sunday. So that'll be good. Does anybody else want the transfer of the day? This is the transfer of the day and it is $39.99. And you can put it on any surface that you want. If you have a surface at home that you want to put it on, like maybe you could put it inside of a cupboard if you wanted to hide it. Or um, you can purchase one of our surfaces. I really like this surface because um, it's erasable. So, um, you know, you're gonna need a chalkboard type of thing so that you can erase the, the menu. Um, so, but, you know, of course you don't have to get it from us if you don't want to. I really like ours. I have found that out of all the surfaces that I've used, Chalk Couture surfaces really are the best. And I'm not just saying it because I sell it. Uh, it's, it's the truth. But you know, that's how it usually is with direct sales, is direct sales quality is usually 10 times better than anywhere else. So actually, I wonder I could put these, I could put these over here. I'll start with the pepper on the right. Yeah, this, this squeegee is getting messy too. I like a fresh squeegee. That's why I love our mini squeegees. You get 12 to a pack. Hi Denise. This is going to be so cute. And what I especially love, what I especially love about this, is I didn't make any mess ups. <laughs> Usually I'm all about messing up, but this time, I mean, yeah, I messed up the Wednesday, but for the most part, I did really good on this one. Actually, I'm gonna stagger this and put the salt down a little bit. I probably spoke too soon on the messing up. All right, I think that's gonna be good. Okay, so if anybody wants this transfer of the day, comment below, transfer of the day, and then you'll get to pick a free gift. The free gift is one of these 12 prizes. Just pick a number, one through 12, and it is yours. Perfect, guys, it's so gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Let me clean up real quick and then I will show it to you up close. I have a big mess here with this white and this white is almost gone already. Jeez, I've been using it a lot lately, I guess. Usually these um, three ounce chalk pastes last forever even as often as I make designs. Okay, so here we go. Can you see it okay? Is the lighting all right? Give me some hearts if you like it. Isn't that awesome? I'm so excited. Okay, so now 
maybe you guys can watch me. Um, hi, Brandy. Let's see. Um, Debbie, I will send you a message when we are done with this live and we will, you know, we can talk about that. Oh, you had a minor procedure. So Subway's your dinner. I hope all everything is okay. You said minor, so I assume it is. Okay, so actually I was going to um, use the chalk markers to figure out the rest of my week, but I just remembered. Um, actually, I can break into these. I, I sold these to a customer, and but I'm getting a new pack tomorrow. So I am good to go. All right, let me grab my little poker to open this. Okay. I have not used our chalk markers yet. So when you get these chalk markers, you get um, a black one and a white one. So we're gonna need the white one for this project, but if I had made this on a white surface, which we have, hi Kimberly, um, then I would have used the black marker, which we could do too, because we have lots of surfaces that um, have white, that are white instead of black. Okay, so let's see, Tuesday, what day is today? Today is Tuesday. Tomorrow is Wednesday. What should I make for dinner tomorrow? I wonder if this is one of those markers that you have to get started first. And I don't have any. I'm just going to. Yeah, can you guys see how that works? You have to get the chalk down in there. Let's go. It's taking its sweet time. Oh, here it goes. It started. Um, let me erase that. Okay, guys, what should we have for dinner tomorrow night? I don't have any of my recipes with me. <coughs> um, Friday, I'm out of town, so I can only fill out Wednesday and Thursday. So maybe we will have lasagna tomorrow. And then we can have grilled ch chicken on the grill. Chicken on the grill with um, corn on the cob. How does that sound? Yummy, corn on the cob. This works really good. I like that a lot. Okay, so then um, when you're done with the week, you just take your board eraser and you erase it and you start all over. How great is that? Oh my gosh, I love this. Okay, so here it is. You guys can see it one more time. Okay, if you guys want this transfer, comment below transfer of the day and then pick a number. So Debbie, um, did you pick a number? I didn't see if you did. I'll have to go back. Hi, Nicole. Um, I didn't see if you did pick a number. So the transfer of the day is the menu board. And um, if you purchase that for $39.99, you get um, to pick one of these prizes. So just comment below transfer of the day and, um, and then pick a number. And then I will um, let you know what your, um, Debbie, you picked number 10. Okay, awesome. So I'm gonna have to go over to my um, VIP page because I'm not allowed to announce any kind of winners or anything on a public format. So I will go over there next. All right, um, guys, if you want this transfer of the day, you have 24 hours from right now to hi Annette to um, comment below transfer of the day. So that's when this is going to expire is um, within 24 hours. So you can still um, 
purchase that later. So thank you guys for watching. And as always, don't forget, oh my gosh, don't go anywhere. I want to show you something. Okay, this is our new Club Couture. This is, um, if you guys saw on my page, this is a cute little hedgehog. Isn't he cute? So um, cl uh, Club Couture is where you sign up for a monthly design and each month this would get mailed to you. And, um, and so every single month you get a whole new design that you can create. And you don't just create one design with it. If you had several different surfaces, you can put this everywhere. And actually I saw that somebody put this in their bathroom, on their bathroom wall, um, like, you know, at somewhere in their bathroom, like down towards the bottom. It was really, really cute. So you can use this everywhere. So Club Couture is really, really fun. And um, it's only $19.99 a month. And what I love about it is the surprise effect. You don't know what you're gonna get. But every month, the um, designs that are, um, that I've seen people create with this have been so cool, just really cool, especially July. July, I think it was July, was um, the Celebrate Freedom, or maybe that, that might have been May, I don't remember, but the Celebrate Freedom one was really great and really fun. So anyways, um, if you're interested in joining Club Couture, go to my um, website, which is listed above here, and just click Club Couture, and it will walk you through the process of signing up for that. So um, that is that. And if you guys are local, I do local workshops, and I am having a workshop on the 30th of August at 7 p.m. It's a Friday. Um, so make sure that you message me or comment below to let me know if you're interested in that and I can let you know the project that we're gonna be doing. This month is gonna be really super cute. It's been a really popular one. All right, gang, um, thank you so much for joining me and I will talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.